Okay. <clears throat> How's everybody? No, that things were gonna go this way. I just didn't know. I mean, here's where I work. This is where I work. Vic, did you hear that Doug and them are coming? Hi, Victor. Victor's back from Mexico. He just drove up the driveway. <laughs> did you hear that Doug? Yeah, it's a little chilly here, isn't it? It's a little chilly. That was from landfill. Yeah, it is. Um, Keeping them warm. You heard that Doug and the landfill rat are going to come I out did. here and help me. I talked to landfill a lot when I was in Mexico. Yeah, he's a great guy. So, yeah, we're all coming out. Yeah. I got a place for them to stay if they need. Good. And uh, I got the wood for you. That's for sure. Yeah. So that's, we got all the wood. Yeah. So we got to get that out here. Well, can load it up on my trailer and bring it on out. You hearing this, friends? So Victor has got wood. I've got some wood, but it's been... I didn't take care of it that good. I, I, it might be pretty rough, but it, it won't be well, rotten. I've got some rough, rough stuff too, but we got the planer. Yeah. Plane off. Well, and I don't know if we need to. Well, plane off some of the rod and whatnot. But you know what we should think about doing? For, so anyways, friends, what I was going to say. Oh, hey, you know what? Something just hit me. Um, We're building a shop. We're, we're, we're building it. We're building it right along the side of my thing. I got to get some siding on that freaking SB board. My wife just, she just hates that. But those are low priority things for me. What's priority is mortgage food. You know what I mean? It just is. I don't, you know. Anyway, me and uh, uh, Nick cut this up, friends. I want to look at this. Look at freaking this, Victor. Yeah. This is that maple. Yeah. Oh, look at that. Little mushrooms starting already. Look at that. Don't take them long in this Isn't moisture. Isn't that cool, eh? A little bit of moisture. But look at these slabs of maple, friends. They are wicked. I would like to incorporate these into my uh, shop, maybe. It's your benches. Well, it could be. It could be That's my benches. Use them for. It could be my benches. They will take a beating. Yes, they will. You know. So, there's another one I got to cut up. and. Well, that's what I mean. I at think at the same time. I mean, this stuff's nice. Friends. You're not going to get a much nicer bench than that. No, but they, the benches themselves take a pretty good beating. And the oil and the grease and the watka. And, and that's, that's fine. Nice look at this though, Victor. I know. Come on. L look at that. Look at that. Oh, this is one of the nicest pieces I've got right here. <laughs> hey, Blaze, look at this, buddy. I should take a picture and, and ship this out to Blaze. I think I'll do that. Anyway, friends, I've got some here, but nah, I, I, you know what? I've probably got the, uh, it's good. I, I just stuff along the grass ain't going to yeah. be good, but. It's gonna look good. You guys get a little lick in there. I, what I want to do, Vic, go on one side, Vic, and we'll just quickly flip these out and get these beams up. I've been needing help with this. Let's actually, um, this start here. Yeah. Okay, one, two, three. This one. One, two, three. Yeah. So we're good, friends. We got lumber. Yeah. We've so got, we've got the lumber. And it's gonna be lean to style, right? But, uh, Anyways, I gotta get that. Vic, would you mind grabbing that box out of the back of the crew cab? I'll get us set up. Um, so friends, uh, yeah, I, I, I don't know. I thought that was actually a pretty interesting idea. So <clears throat> anyway, um, I need to do something right now. I need to do something. This this freaking channel is, I'm getting a lot of emails lately, friends. And, uh, and I, I don't, I like to share certain ones, okay? And, and, and there's been a little bit of a theme. Thanks, Victor. Maybe just toss it right up here. That's oh a big God. box. That's from Greg, downtown Brown. So there's been a theme of, of people kind of coming home after work, Vic. I've been, I've been getting these, like I just read one inside there. People are coming home from work and they're sitting down with their families and this one fella says, he says, Buck, and you, you know, your videos, when I watch them, I just, I'm in a better mood after the video's done. That just makes me, it just keeps me making videos. I'm just telling you straight now, that's the type of fuel I need to go because I put a lot of time into this thing and I love it. Don't get me wrong. Um, 
but it is time consuming. And when I get emails like that, and when there's little people donate, and when there's little hits and little stuff like that, that's the energy that us creators not need, but sure enjoy to keep going. So thank you for that. Um, on that note, Taylor, Mr. Taylor, he, and actually his wife, Amanda, sent me an email. She sent me an email first. Um, and then he sent one after. Just just thanking. And, and you know what? Taylor, buddy, thank you for your support on building this shack out here. And that was another reason. He said, isn't that neat? Uh, Taylor helped out with the building of the shack. He just he emailed up. I guess he caught the live feed there. And, and he, it was his first one. And he said, uh, Buck and I want to help uh, support. He's in Ontario, Taylor. And he says, I just want to help support uh, you building your, your Buck and Bunker out there. The Buck and Army Bunker. <laughs> and I was like, what a guy. So, Taylor, thanks, bud. Thanks so much for that. Drop the billet that's glowing <laughs> red on the floor. Yeah, that is true. Friends, this is Greg Brown, downtown Brown's package. He sent, okay? Now, one second here. I got to do one thing here. Mr. Taylor, feather, it's feather. How do you pronounce that, Taylor? Featherston. Featherston. Taylor Featherston. You dirty dog, you. Buddy, thank you so, so much for your support. Just huge. What a guy. And your wife. I believe it's Amanda. Eh? Is it not? I think it is. <clears throat> Excuse me. Yeah. You guys are awesome. I haven't finished reading your, actually, your email yet. So, Greg, Downtown Brown. Look at this. Oh, he's created something here for me. Uh -oh. what, what is this thing? What? I saw him building this. What is this? This is intense. Uh-oh. Downtown Brown, what have you done? This is exciting. I got to put this down on the ground. Oh, sorry, Victor. Look at the packing. What is this, Victor? I saw him make this. Be kind. He's gone on there. What have you done? Oh, oh good. I see some treats for Chester. Pocket knife. Holy cow, milk bones for Chester? For Chester and Chica. Oh, and Chica. Greg Brown, you wild man! Now, I saw this, and I actually don't know what this is. Well, there's a note on the front. Right there. Oh, Greg. What is this? this I bet you this is something for organizing something. What does that say? Oh, Bucking needs that. What is this? Bucking, you got a saw tree, but you need a tool. Oh, there you go. Yeah. A tool tree. This bottle of flits. Use it on axe handles. Wendy Smith. Oh, nice. Oh, flits right here. Uh, knife, gun, and knife wax. Uh, what do you got here? What is it? Use it on your handles, axe handles. Yeah. Rub that in. Hard, Cletus. <laughs> Greg Brown, bucking me and the family photos with shirts on. Bucking. Get me family photos with shirts on. Oh, he must have sent shirts. He's got shirts in here. Oh, Greg Brown. Yeah, buddy. Oh, cool. Oh, look at these shirts. Very nice. Greg Brown, General Call Types of Concrete Tree Trimming Bucket Service. Oh, Greg, way to go, bud. Friends, are you are you picking this guy, Greg Brown? I'll tell you something right now. We talk every single day. Every day, without a doubt. He sends me some crazy text message or something. There. Oh, there's a pocket knife. There's a pocket knife. Oh, look at that. Greg Brown. It's a Greg Brown downtown Brown construction knife, friends. Ha <laughs> ha. Greg, buddy, I love you, pal. You know that. This is incredible. I don't even... Gosh, I don't know what to say here. <clears throat> it's a tool tray. 
for wedges. Look at this thing, Victor. Gosh, Greg. Looks like some kind of carnival game. Well, I saw him making this. So it must go. Oh. So it bolts down. Yeah. Now it'll go onto the table. I wonder if. No. That, no. that definitely goes in here. Yeah. So I wonder. Greg Brown, you're a maniac. Oh, 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 okay. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah. That's what I'm thinking. Yeah. And then you bolt it down. Yeah. So that's it. I guess this is for tools and that. Or. Look at that, friends. Well, yeah, you can, you know. That's exactly right. That's exactly right. All my tools. And actually what I could do. Cause that's pretty high up there, right? Isn't it? A little bit. I mean, you could you could chop that tube down. Yeah, I could. Nothing. Or we could. Wow, Greg, you dirty dog. This is wicked. Oh yeah, no, that's exactly how yeah. that goes. Yeah. It has to go that yeah. way. Wow, Greg, that's wicked, bud. Look at this, buds. He's got bolts and everything ready to go for me. Well, he knows he's seen our bolt bin here. Yep. He knows we're not gonna find four of a kind. Look at that, friends. That's a tool, a tool tree. He says I got a saw tree, but I don't have a tool tree. Now I do. So I can put tools up there, maybe in theirs. This is gonna be great for the new shop, Mr. Brown. I take it you're flying out to come bang some nails with us, are you? Had a guy, good fella. Greg, bring your own hammer because we only have we only have stumpies. Look at this, friends. Look at that. A freaking tool tray. Tool tree. Greg, you're a what a guy. That could even go down over off to the side somewhere. It could. I could weld you up a bracket that goes off to the side too. Wow. If Greg so lets me. That's pretty cool. Thanks, Greg. And Taylor Featherston, thanks again, buddy. And Amanda, your wife. Oh, we got our 2100 fired up, friends. I think it's fired up anyway. thing this is what I'm talking about friends that this is the part of the channel that I just didn't I, I just didn't even think about this type of thing happening no you know no. you don't you don't think about this when you throw a tree cutting video on and you just you know you throw a video or two on and <clears throat> all of a sudden people started kind of coming in friends I did not grow fast I didn't did I Vic in the beginning nope. I remember we were jumping for joy when 1500 people or yeah like I didn't I didn't friends I did not grow quickly in the beginning um it was a slow grind I had 652 subscribers when logger Wade gave me a shout out yeah and I damn near did a backflip yeah we hit 1500 and yeah it was like oh my god there's yeah. 1500 people watching I know I was just like I couldn't believe it then I hit five grand and I was like I have 5,000 people <laughs> now we're at 17,700 and something. Yep. We're at 177 friends and I just but but quant, you know qual, quantity is not everything. No, we have quality. The quality here is is what I'm talking about, the quality of people. Yep. You know, this is no joke friends. The the, the people and and friends, I'm not one of those folks you guys already know it. 
I'm not one of those guys that films myself out there doing good deeds and down on the street helping the homeless. I just do it. I don't. I, I find filming myself do good deeds is, is doesn't feel right, Victor. No. It feels strange to me. It it it. I think it it just doesn't work for me. I'm not into it. There's lots of guys that do it, and I think it's a great thing. And you know they're kind in their heart and they're genuine. But I, I, when you film it, it just something's not. For, doesn't work for me. I'm not that guy. Um, so, so the the kindness that rolls around this channel in the comment section, and just it, it's amazing. That's all I can say. It's just amazing. Like Greg Brown, come on. Guy sends my pets, sends my pets goodies. <clears throat> you know, sends Wendy something. He's giving Wendy something. A little sap and gasoline. <laughs> This year is going to be crazy, Victor. It's already been pretty nuts. It's not bad, not bad. So I missed the big chunk of it, but yeah, yeah, I know. So anyway, friends, uh, Greg, thanks, bud. I forget what we even came out here for. What was this? What was this? Yeah, it was yeah, this. Yeah. yeah. And Taylor, Taylor Featherston. I wanted to thank Taylor. Taylor sent a couple shackles uh, so to help out towards the. Uh, the new bunker out the back, the Buck and Army bunker, the Army bunker. What do you call them things? Is it bunkers yeah, for the yeah, Army? Yep. Bu the Buck and Army bunker? Yep. We're going to have a name for that thing. Bunker sounds good. Bunker sounds pretty good. Buckins, Buckins, people have called it Buckins. Uh, Buckins bunker. Buckins bunker? Yeah, Buckins bunker. <laughs> Might as well keep the bees going. Bunker bunker. Buckins bunker. Cool. Okay. Let's get back at her. We got some stuff to do. I wanted to show, I showed you guys the axe handles already previously and the rain. Over and out, friends. Be kind. Talk to you soon.